The stripeless zebra. Zebi was a lonely, stripeless zebra. One day, Zolo, her brother, told her that she did not belong there. Zebi, I saw someone just like you today in those nearby grasslands. Maybe if you could find him, then you might get some friends. What do you mean, Zolo? Don't you say for yourself, you don't have any stripes, you are nothing like any of us, you don't belong here. Mom, is it true that I do not belong here? Oh baby darling, of course you belong here, you are a stripeless zebra. Zebi thought her mom was consoling her with a lie. Zebra stripe patterns are like human fingerprints. The stripes are unique to each zebra. Zebi set out to see if Zolo was right. Just as Zolo mentioned, she saw someone like her in the grasslands. Hello there. Do I look like someone among you? I don't think so. You don't have pointy ears or gold eyes like I do. But don't you worry, let me check with my dad. He might know who you are. Dad, do you know who she is? No, dear, but I am sure she is not one among us. Zebi was disappointed, so she started walking far away. Soon, she again saw someone who looked like her. Hello, do you think I look like someone among you? I don't think so. You don't seem tall enough to be one among us. But don't you worry. Let me check with my mom. She might know who you are. Mom, do you know who she is? No, darling, but I'm sure she is not one among us. Poor Zebi. She decided that she will never be able to get friends. That is when she met DJ and Toto. Hello. You seem lost. Is there any way we could help you? She explained her problem. And all the three set out to meet the wise Monchi. Monchi, this is Zebi. Can you tell us who she is? Of course. She is a stripeless zebra. I may be. But because I don't have any stripes, I don't have any friends. Oh, now I understand your problem. You need stripes to get friends. Hmm, let me think. Yeah, I know. A stripeless zebra can get her stripes when she helps somebody in need. Zebi started walking hopelessly around the forest. Zebi saw Red floating in water one day. She immediately pulled her out. Red thanked Zebi for saving her life. Next day, Zebi woke up to find a white stripe on her. She felt excited that she shared it with DJ and went to meet Toto. On her way, she met Effie who seemed lost. I lost my way and I could not find my mom. Don't worry Effie, I saw Elsa down by the river. She must still be there. Because of Zebi? Effie found her mom down by the river. The next day, Zebi got one more stripe on her. She shared the happy news with Toto, DJ, Effie and Elsa, and with Red. Soon, Zebi started getting more stripes, and she got more people now to share her happiness with. That made Zebi realize something, and she rushed. To meet Monchi. Monchi, 
I have friends who don't care how I look. I don't need these stripes anymore. I look beautiful without them. Could you by any chance take them off of me? Thank God you realized that it is not stripes that gets you friends. I was running out of paint. So, what is the moral that we learnt along with Zebi today? It is great character that gets you good friends. Thank you for watching Kids Eat It. Subscribe for more videos. Thank you. Bye bye.